Hey, 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 y'all. Welcome back to the channel. For those of you that are on for the first time, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Hit the bell so that each and every time I upload a video, you will be the first to be notified. So guys, we're going to get right into this video. I'm not going to prolong, not going to talk about anything, just about what this video is about, okay? So a lot of you have been stating that people are complaining, or some of you have um, customers that are complaining that they do not have um, the money to invest in gift baskets. And truthfully speaking, some people really don't, okay? A lot of people are just shooting jive, but there are some people that legitimately do not have a lot of money to spend due to the rising costs in food, everyday living, but they do want to buy something for their loved ones, for Christmas, for their birthday, for whatever it may be. So guys, these are some little popular trays from the Dollar Tree, right? I teach you guys about unbaskets all the time. This is a form of an unbasket of what I call any type of container that is not an actual basket, but it gives the same presentation as a gift basket, guys. So these trays came from Dollar Tree and everything that you see in this particular basket did come from Dollar Tree. I mentioned on a previous video that these came from Dollar General, but they did not. The actual Yardley sprays that I had on a previous video came from Dollar General, but these actually came from Dollar Tree. So each and everything that you see in this basket, in this tray, came from Dollar Tree. So here we have one, two, three items and a tray, which is four items, which means $5, okay? And we'll just go ahead and add an extra dollar, even though it's not a dollar's worth because I haven't used a full um, spool of ribbon. But with the ribbon and the actual plastic, excuse me, guys, we'll just say that we spent $6, okay? So what we're going to do is create quite a few of these guys, okay? It's not going to break the bank. You probably won't make tons and thousands and thousands of dollars, but I can guarantee you that you will get into the hundreds and possibly into the thousands if you know how to work your game, okay? So all of these items in this particular basket, this came from Dollar Tree, this came from Target for 99 cents. And I got this from City Trends for, it was less than a dollar. I don't know if it was a dollar 70 cent, but I didn't pay more than a dollar. So again, you have one, two, three items and the basket itself and the bow. We'll just say this particular one, because it was $1, $2, $3.25, $4.50. We spent about $5. We don't want to spend over $5 on these trays, right? But each and every tray, we're going to have... If you go out and vend, and I suggest that you do, that's what I teach on this channel all the time to hit the streets. Guys, get you a table that only has $20 gifts on it, and it's going to be loaded with these trays. I'm giving you an idea for the upcoming holidays, for festivals. A lot of people be like, what you got for $20? Only got $20. Well, I told you guys, it's hard to make baskets now for $10 because a lot of you have been saying that you were charging $10 for gifts. It's actually really, really hard to charge $10 for anything in this day and time. To um, Even though you might only cost, a, it only cost you a few cents to um, buy it and make it. But at the same token, when you put your labor and creativity in it, it's definitely going to be more than $10. So these are some great gifts, guys. Do not put more than three items. Get you three items that's $0.99 cent or less, or I'll say $1.25 or less, since a lot of us shop at Dollar Tree. I'm going to say $1.25. Do not pay more than $1.25 for three items and put them in your basket, guys. You can actually do a Dove um, three-piece set. You can do this. You can do a Dove soap. And now they have Dove hand wash at some stores for, like, I think, like a dollar and fifty cent. The whole idea of this particular thing is to not spend over five dollars, but charge twenty dollars. Twenty dollars out the door for this tray. Here, take it. You got it. Twenty dollars. So really, really quick assembly. Um, really, really simple. Even if you don't know how to make gift baskets, all you got to do is place the items neatly on the tray. You can stand them up. You can set them down. Sitting them down, I can promise you, is going to be much, much easier if you're not familiar with making gift baskets or you're still learning. But guys, get you three inexpensive items, put them on these trays, and they're going to be $20 out the door. I promise you these gifts will fly off the table. You won't have to worry about them. You won't have to run people down and get them to purchase them. 
these items will go out the door quickly. And guess what? For those of you like me that end up selling out before the holiday is over, these are items that you can sit right at your vending spot and make while people are coming up to your table, guys. Just get you a an abundance of these trays. Keep them and have them on hand for when the holiday come and you're running out of these. But I promise you with the pandemic and people not really having a whole bunch of money, these trays will be a sure shot winner. Let me know in the comments below if you plan to make some of these trays, if you think that they're a good idea or you don't. Leave me a comment in the um in the comment section below okay guys i hope you like this video if you like this video please like share comment and subscribe hit the bell so that each and every time i upload a video you will be the first to be notified get your money honey and fill your bag until the next video bye bye